The last position we're going to talk about before we go into some kind of active rolling is back control. Back control is when you have somebody's back. Now, if Blake is on my back, what am I supposed to do? Get him off. Who said that? Did you say that? Oh, no, Gabriel said that. <laughs> I was like, I'm so happy. Who said that? Oh. Face the problem. Just a really good black problem. <laughs> so, getting there, it, it oftentimes it just happens. The bottom guy it tries to go belly down. I think it's one of those natural instincts that people have to go belly down and try to get back to their feet. You do not give your back up. What do we do? We turn towards problems, right? We face the problem. We run, run towards the sound of gunfire. That's what we do. So if I'm in mount here and I'm just wailing on him, a lot. this is what they're going to do. They're going to turn over. They're going to try to go belly down. Then he's going to try to do a push-up and he's going to try to get to his feet. I have his back now. Controlling, all I need is to be able to control his hips. Sometimes that means I have hooks in like this where my feet are actually inside of his legs. Sometimes it might be just me, I'm on the outside of his legs, locking myself in place by squeezing, kind of with like my groin and, and quads in on him so he can't get away. I mean here, so everything that's illegal in the UFC is exactly what you want to do. So where am I going to punch him? I'm going to hit him, not the back of the head, I'm going to hit him in the back of the neck, right here. I'm going to draw my elbows down straight like this, and straight like this in the back of his neck. In the UFC, I'm only allowed to punch where my gloves can touch his ears. That's stupid. Um, well, it's good because it's a sport, and that's why um, sport fighting is not fighting. If I get somebody to go like this and leave all the deadly areas. <laughs> I thought Kel 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 Kelvin Geslum, that's exactly what he did. He just went like this and covered his ears. We're in a street fight, I go like this, that's the end of the fight. Trevor Prangley, one of our instructors, he says make soup with their face. So as soon as he gets in somebody's back, he presses down like this and he just grinds their face into the cement and asphalt. Sometimes he'll grab their eyes or their nose and he just pulls them up and then slams them back down. That's exactly what I would do. When he's wow. grinding my face into the ground, what do I want to do? <laughs> yeah, as I push down, I'm gonna go. You're gonna push up <laughs> right into chokes, giving me space for my hips. So back control. We're gonna roll over. We're gonna talk about getting out of it. What is he supposed to do? He's supposed to turn towards the problem, right? So he's gonna push the legs out, push the legs out, and he's gonna roll in. The movement is really similar to a shrimp. Just like getting out of side control, if I'm here, I can just strip to get him back into my guard. If, he's, if I have his back, it's really the movement of a shrimp. Elbows are in, I'll do it on the side so it really looks like a shrimp. Push, push, push. Shrimp off of his leg even sometimes and come to side control. So th this is, you are not supposed to be here. You guys know how to escape the mount, so even just getting my back to the ground and forcing him to come on top of me is at least now I know kind of a move from there, right? Believe it or not, giving up the mount is better than being on the back, right? We're showing this as a um, opportunity for you to be familiar with it. This is more familiarization. I don't want you to fight from here. Uh, Self-defense wise, this isn't a great place. Um, it's good for sports jujitsu. If I can put him belly down and be able to make soup of his face or tear an eye out um, or knock him unconscious with a north-south. Have you seen us punch with closed fists yet? No, we don't do that because you'll break your hand and you need your hands to shoot, to fight, to start a car, dial 911. Right? We need these. So none of that. We don't, don't do that. So I actually want to be on top. So if I had my choice, I would go right into mount, and so I could get back to work. Ow. Questions about back control. So one, don't give it up. There are gonna be times, who here wrestled? So you're gonna have a natural um, want to go belly down and start looking for wrestling solutions. Um, we will choke you out. And we'll take your face and we'll put it against the mat and I'll take my finger and I'll put it up against your eye and remind you that I'm tearing your eye out. Um, it's just a really bad instinct that doesn't translate to actual fighting. We always turn and face the problem. Mm.